Hello, fitness family. Good morning to you. Good afternoon. Good evening. Wherever you are, come on. Let's go for a long beach walk. Okay. So we all know how healthy it is to walk on the beach. Okay. It's just so good for your mind, your overall body. Just it's so so good. Okay. So come along with me. Let me take you for a walk while we look at beautiful places and just enjoy the beautiful nature. Okay. All right, so let's just walk. We're going to walk to the next community. Then we're going to go down to the beach from the next community, okay, from the next town. So just come along with me while we just look at the beautiful things that God has made, okay? And we should just enjoy our walk. All right, so let me know in the comment section if you're someone that you used to go to the beach for a walk or you do road walking, off road. Let me know what you what you do, which one you prefer. For me, it depends. When I just want to walk and just exercise a little bit, I do either road or beach. But when I want to push myself harder, I go for up the mountain. So that way, I have to go to the back of the town and go up the hills which is more difficult, more challenging, okay? So let me know in the comment section which one you do. All right, so here is a fun park that in summertime is filled with people, you know, like they have a lot of tourists that they come here with their kids just to play because they have like a mini golf course here and just place that people can sit down and relax. They have bars and so on and so forth, okay? A lot of fun stuff that you can do with your family, okay? So lot of hotels restaurants places to chill out okay if you want to rent like um, ATV bikes to go for off-road driving just so so many fun things this road is cool of people in summertime like you have to squeeze yourself through people but yeah we're still on lockdown uh, most countries have not really opened their borders so you can see how empty it is all right so we're going down to the beach from here okay we're taking the first road okay this is not the first this is the second okay from <laughs> the next town this is the beginning of the next town it's called ayam arena so we're going down from the second road that leads to the beach here there's a big hotel here by the side here that you see the brown wall it's a hotel all the way from the road down to the beach okay all of this that i'm, that I'm showing you right now is the hotel okay summertime they used to put birds down here so you can rent any bed for yourself, your partner, your family and just chill in the beach, enjoy your drink, swim, all of that. Now there's an umbrella down here. Okay, so let me quickly give you a backstory. Now you can see my little one running. When we were coming down, when we turned into this road, she was like screaming, screaming because she thought we were going back home. She loves the outdoors. She just wants to be outside. She wants to play. She loves to throw stones. She loves swimming. So anything concerning beach, she is fully interested. All right, guys. So I'm just giving you, as you see me waving my hands, I'm just giving you the backstory of what's going on. I had to do a voiceover because the wind was so so strong i wasn't expecting this much uh, wind on this day but well you live in an island so everything is expected all right so be right behind me you will see there's a family behind there playing uh, a volleyball and then people are just chilling in the beach because there's um, a lot of sun today and it's just a nice day it's windy very windy but it's really nice it is warm okay i would say even hot <laughs> Okay, but it's really windy, people are chilling, you know, uh, laying down in the sun and just having their tan. While we were here to do the beach walking, to exercise my little one, she has a lot of energy, so yeah, let's do this. If you've not done a uh, beach walkout, uh, like beach walking, not walkout, beach walking, like walking in the beach, taking off your shoes and just walking on the sand for a long distance or a short distance depending on the time you have on your hands let me know in the comment section it is very good if you have a beach close to you please do it it is super good to just walk on the sand for as long as you can it's a very good exercise okay so today we're having a very long walk okay <laughs> i will see if my little one can handle it i've never uh, walked with her this long distance but we will see i will let you know at the end so watch this video till the end if you want to know if my little one completed the walk or not okay so let's stick together 
Okay, right here she wants to throw some stones as you see. So we're just throwing stones, playing and um, allowing her to have some fun before we go for the walking because we're walking all the way to the other end. You really cannot even see the end from here because the distance is far, okay? All right, so here am I talking to you people. <laughs> okay, all right, all right, okay, so... Just taking a spin showing you there's a lot of hotels like i always say this lots and lots of beach side hotels like if you're coming to greece you just you have so many choices okay if you're someone that you like staying close to the beach then you have your option of choosing the beach side hotel if you're someone that you want to stay close up to the mountains and all that valleys and that's your own the type of stuff you like you also have a uh, lot of hotels up in the mountain area so you just have so many choice to make like you have so many varieties like whatever you want you you just gonna get it all right so we have been walking for a long time now as you see you just saw her on the camera she's still walking and we're almost there i didn't think she would be able to complete this walk because this is the first time we're going on a beach walk for this distance if it was on the road i know she could but i was really surprised that she was just running playing throwing stones and she was able to walk this whole distance with me she did very good so okay bravo to little one <laughs> okay so from here we're going to go up to the main road and walk all the way back home but i'm not sure she will be able to get all the way to the house she will be tired because it is really a long distance so let me know have you walked on the beach before on the sand do you do it is it something that you do or you just love to just do your walking on the road because i see a lot of people do the road you know, just walk on the road or jog on the road do your exercise very few people do the beach walking and beach running or all the beach workout and you need to do the beach but i'm just telling you today that if you've not been doing it please start doing it as far as you have a beach close to you have sand close to you please do it it is a good way to exercise and train your leg it's a good way to challenge your body okay all right so this place that we are right now we're going up to the main road from here here is red havana this place is called red havana it's super super busy in summertime you have this one is uh, red havana after red havana the next one you have uh on another one that's called cabana man telling you completely packed if you come here 7 a.m in, uh, in summertime you will not get any bed okay it is super cool people book from days before it's busy it's so beautiful they have so many fun things to do in there they play like dj's they're blasting music they're like dancing partying music food drinks sushi anything you want to so this area you cannot find a place to park even to walk up by the left by my right side it's a big hotel and restaurant and on this other side is uh, red havana so this street this whole area is packed with people like there's traffic human traffic we're not talking about car vehicles we're talking about human traffic there is full traffic you cannot even pass okay they have big um parking space their parking space is filled up around nine in the morning you will not find any space to park your car so much cars on the road in their parking lot so many people it's super busy but you can see how empty it is right now okay i do not know if they will open this summer like if Greece will open their borders if they open their borders i will show you people what i'm talking about okay you will see for yourself firsthand what I'm talking about, how busy this area used to be in summertime. You know, like the island of Crete is one island that people really love visiting because it has so many beautiful places to go to. They have so many things that you can do with your family, okay? It's very, it's a family-friendly country, okay? So you're not afraid of, oh, can I bring my family? Would it be safe and all that? It's a very safe place and comfortable for people. Some people are really loving it all over europe and far us everywhere in the world you see them coming to greece for their summer because if it's a fun place it's warm 
okay most of the people that are coming from cold countries you see them walking without shoes walking with just their singlets because the weather is so beautiful they don't even want to go back home because the weather here is so so good so thank you very much for wa watching up to this extent now we're going back home thank you so much